10 ridiculous crashes in Red Bull soapbox race. Spins, drop, and damage in a crazy crafted car race. How could that not be fun? Here are the most epic ones. Ready, set, laugh. Number one, Speed Story. Do you remember this race in Toy Story? Well, these guys will replicate it hilariously. Woody and Buzz make their way down the track, go through the car wash, and they seem to have gotten into the rhythm, but they lose it. A push and they get in right again. Everything goes well until they go down the stairs and the co-pilot flies out. Sorry, I meant he fell with style. What are you doing, cowboy? You're leaving him behind. I think you no longer have a friend in him. Well, at least the soapbox car went to the infinity and beyond foolishness. Number two, pirates in the race. Two soapbox vehicles are better than one, especially if it's about pirates. This open sea pair set sail to conquer the track. Let's see how long they can sail together. Ow, ouch. Apparently not long, but the journey hasn't ended yet. They split and the prow crashes catastrophically into the floor. Pretty please, repeat that epic drop in slow motion. Definitely, we lower the mast at this point. Too bad you didn't have the wind at your back today, guys. Number three, Rubik's Cube. The next one is none other than a Rubik's Cube with all its faces showing just one color, of course. I can't figure out how many hours these guys spent solving it, so I hope this vehicle doesn't crash into something and gets destroyed by a hit. As I thought, this soapbox car is competing in a very didactic way. It balances smartly on the first obstacle and suddenly, bye bye to all the pieces. All right, relax, pilot. You only have to succeed with the other end. Ooh, ouch, he fell face down. Well, at least it can't get worse. Uh, you know what, just forget it. Number four, Barbie driver. I'll need some help to drive this soapbox car, I think. I can help. <laughs> I'm tour guide Barbie. Great, because this one matches your style. You only need to push it and come on, Barbie, let's go party. Apparently, we'll be early because these kickers are so easy to drive over that they're Barbie's play for this vehicle, except for the last one. Watch out, you may crash, you may. Oh my, Mattel, that's a drop. It's a pity. We were looking at this race through rose colored glasses. Number five, balloon carriage. The next one going through the route of shame is this carriage that, by the way, seems to be stolen from a kid's birthday party. Or is this the same vehicle Cinderella used after coming back from a carnival? Never mind, these balloons will soften the pathetic crashes, but he's doing very well so far. He manages to stay up the ramp order, he's getting to the finish line without looking foolish, and he rolls noisily into the bush. Wow, that's a grand finale. Number six, Naked Moai. Building a soapbox car inspired by this Easter Island statue? It's an original idea, but driving it wearing only a loincloth? Dude, these are guaranteed laughs. A short choreography for luck and this soapbox car starts. The pilot masters the curves with energy and there we go. Quickly, let's get this four-wheeled machine back on course. Not all of you at the same time. Wait, don't get anxious. By just one of you jumping and... Okay, this looks like a gag cartoon without a caption. Be careful, stairs ahead. A classic. Number seven, crashed aircraft. Ready to take off? This is an incredible, well-built aircraft. Sure, they did their best on the design. It's perfect engineering work. Nothing can go wrong. The pilot gains momentum and moves along the track at full speed. He looks stable, gets ready to overcome the first obstacle, and... Oh no, they flew in a nosedive! We must make a forced landing. There's damage everywhere. Now I get why they were carrying those parachutes. Thank goodness. Number eight, last propulsion. If you're looking for a spectacular entrance, what better way than to do it in a blimp? But I'm telling you, this time you'll remember the exit. He makes all the way down, ready to do anything. The vehicle features furious teeth and threatening red eyes. He's going to slide down the ramp and, 
wow, the blunt bang didn't bother him, so there's no problem. There he is, straight to destroy the finish line, and he did it, literally. Hey, buddy, leave some of the track for the others. Number nine, Grape Team. In this case, the soapbox car was inspired by the family business. This is a wine press. I just hope they haven't taken a sip of their own vintage before the race. The pilot is wobbling a little, and he's not afraid of the colored smoke bomb. He gets ready to go over the bridge, and he nailed it. But it's still hard to be steady. No worries, the finish line is just a smaller ramp away. No, he's gone. Wait, his vehicle is still rolling. Maybe it could have accomplished the goal on its own. Anyway, I believe the pilot will need a glass of wine after this. And now, get ready to watch a true spectacle. He won't stop laughing for hours. Spoiler alert, don't focus on the soapbox car, but on the co-pilot. Number 10, PD Pants. When it comes to catching the bad guys, you must be very fast, especially if you feature an inbuilt jail to put them in. The officer is ready to take the prisoner away and he steps on the gas. It's been a quiet delivery straight to the station up till now, but that step sets up an ambush on him. 911, I want to report a laughable accident. Production, rewind that awful drop, please. Wait, the criminal is running away and losing his pants. Luckily, I've recorded all of it on video. Thanks, internet. When it comes to making a fool of yourself, Red Bull soapbox races are always commonplace. These kind of things make me be a YouTuber. If you don't want gravity to do the same with you in a few hours, like my video, subscribe, and hit the bell icon. And if you want more doses of fun, there's this and this video. Someone tell me how to stop this fit of laughter.